Hi again. My name is Rebel and I'm the Rebel Reseller and today I'm doing the second of my what sold videos which will be for last weekend August 18th through the 20th. Y'all it was awful. Absolutely awful. I think I just went and looked. I sold 27 things that entire weekend. 27. Now hold on. This is the second one. What about yesterday when you did your what sold for the first part of the week? You said sales were kind of down this week the current week and you said yesterday which was friday we okay. shipped five no nope, four. four four things yesterday today if we would have shipped which we didn't because we headed off to yard sales 27 that's not normal y'all you can't do four in 27 that's not me can, nothing changed here can we just stick with 27 i know that would be good i know this is I know, y'all. It's tough. It's tough. Up Which, and down. Up and down. Since you're terrible at the ad, I'm going to do the ad this week. Oh, okay. You do the ad. I'm going to do the ad. <laughs> we'll just make this a little bit longer before I show you what's sold. Easy way, you know, to help support our channel and, you know, and, and what we do here. Um, cheap, easy, and free. Hit the like button. Hit subscribe. the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell so you get the notifications. Um, Share share our channel with somebody if you get the opportunity. We have links to tons of stuff in the description that the things that we use and We have a link to our Amazon store in there, which is the things that we buy on Amazon that our business We've bought bags on there. We've you know um, Printers things like that. We also have affiliate links for eBay if you go, if you need to buy something on eBay, click our affiliate link and we will get, a, even if you don't buy our the item we have linked to, we'll get a little commission from that and that helps support our channel. Uh, yep. We have one through Walmart. So if you need to do your Walmart grocery shopping, it doesn't say Walmart in our link because it's through a, a company called Mavely, but it, the link will take you to Walmart. Do your grocery shopping, buy whatever you want. It doesn't cost you any extra. It just gives us a little, little bit of commission. It varies based on what you buy. Sometimes it's 1%, sometimes it's 4%. Usually it's in the 1% one to 2%. Um, products and services we use um, list perfectly. American Bubble Boy, don't forget to use the coupon codes for those. Usually it's the Rebel Reseller. Sometimes that's too long and it's Rebel Reseller. Uh, but those codes are all in the description down there. The last thing I forgot to talk about was channel memberships. We've got a $5 channel membership level. It's just a cheap way to support us if you want to. We've got a few on there. We call them producers because producers are the people that financially back a TV show or movie. So we've got, you'll see it at the end of every video. And if you want your name added to that, go down below, click join. Wait, now I'm out of here. For real. For real. I don't have a lot to share with you guys. I only sold one thing on Mercari. Nothing on Posh, nothing on Etsy that weekend. So it was just a pitiful weekend, except for one thing. One thing. All right, so Mercari. I sold this Peanuts Snoopy Dog plush um, for $19. It had a little zipper pouch on the back of it, like a little coin purse type thing. And then eBay. Thank goodness for eBay, y'all. All right, Fiesta Lil Huggy Puffer Fish sold for $8.46. Plush Creation Black Bear from 1988 sold for $35.95. Nice. This is Chatterbug's Plush Ladybug. It made sounds, um, sold for $11. I'm loving this huge picture here, y'all. I know eBay's working on stuff because this screen has changed, but I do like this change. Cal Toy Yellow and Purple Monkey Plush sold for $10. Aurora Yoohoo Friends Plush sold for $8.50. Now, if you're new to my channel, I don't do free shipping, so the buyer did pay extra for shipping. Chico's Women's Jacket sold for $16. I love all vintage toys. Fisher Price first, Play School second. These were Play School Wee Animal Rattle toys, um, sold for $8.91. I just picked these up at an estate sale slash yard sale. 
Um, this was a Tupperware lid holder for your cabinet, sold before my sale even took place, $19.95. Now, this person bought two of my um, Winnie the Pooh plush, well, Eeyore, spent $16 on two of them. Lego minifigures. I bought a ton of Legos when we were in Cincinnati last year. I made either individual or small lots of the minifigures. Um, these were the Volcano Explorers. Google Lens helped me figure all of this out. Amazing. Definitely use it for anything and everything to make sure you get as many keywords as you possibly can. These three Legos sold for $13.69. Disney Baby Winnie the Pooh plush sold for $13.69. This is a Dandy International Snoopy Thanksgiving musical animated plush sold for $35. Carter's Tan Bear plush. This was musical sold for $8.46. Thank goodness for the bread and butter, y'all. Mary Meyer Yellow Duck Plush, 2001, sold for $13.45. Bulldog Plush, um, I don't think that this was a specific, like, university or college because the, the tag said K-12 to mascots, so I'm assuming it went to some school, so I just kind of kept it generic. Sold very quickly for $14.95. Calvin Klein women's jeans, $10. They were older, so any offer I'm getting right now that's reasonable, I'm accepting. Minchie's ice cream cone plush, $6.04. It's gone. This was a wooden bridge crane train track. Um, it's been listed quite a while but sold at full asking price, $17.91. American Eagle Women's Jeans sold for $17. Despicable Me Minion Plush sold for $8. This is a Kate Spade by Lennox coffee mug. I picked these up probably two years ago at an estate sale. Paid, it was, they were $5. I went on half price day. I picked up several Kate Spade different mugs. Um, this one sold for um, $23. And I paid $2.50. I picked this up at my favorite little estate sale company we like to go to. This was a plastic sewing basket. Six inch round. Very cute. Sold for $10. This is another thing, as soon as I listed it, it sold. It was a Spark Create Imagine St. Bernard dog. Um, I talk about this in my Walmart video on brands that I like to sell. I, um, this one sold for $14.95. And my saving grace, the best sale I had that weekend is my Jenny Kane sweater. Y'all, I already sold it once for $150. Went to California. She said it didn't fit. Sent it back. I was so sad. Relisted it probably a couple of weeks and it sold again at full price of $199.68 and she's already left me feedback. So I'm, I'm guessing we're good. We're good. But $200 for a sweater, y'all. Sweater. Thank you. If you've stayed this long, I do appreciate it. Um, send me some emojis. I appreciate all the comments you guys give. And let's get to work. That's what I'm getting ready to do. Get to work. Bye.